Hi, Paige Thompson, Rusty Cal Basgro, Technical Agronomist for Northwest Iowa. I'm out taking a look at some plots and some fields today. It's May 26th. As you see, I have my stocking cap on. It is pretty chilly. It's windy, 52 degrees, and uh, spitting a little, little of rain here and there. But right now, uh, as you see behind me, this particular spot, we've got some V2, V3 corn. And as you guys start driving around the countryside, you will see some, some corn that looks a little yellow. And as you get out in the field, you might see some corn that's a little lighter green cast and it's moving from that seed reserves that the corn plant utilizes for its source of life and it'll move to the nodal root system so at the v3 time frame is definitely when there's the beginning of photosynthesis so Again, V3 relies more so on those nodal roots and then the growth of the seminal root system does cease. So let's take a look at some corn. First off, we have the crown, which is the green arrow, and it's the highway that moisture and nutrients are extracted by the root system and are mobilized to the stalk. Very important. Like I said before, at V3, the corn begins to shift the nutritional dependence to those nodal roots. You know, this is important uh, transitional stage. You know, this period can also influence how well that corn plant can tolerate stress later on in the growing season which may also uh, influence yield potential. Looking at the blue arrow, which shows where the mesocotyl is, it's that white tube stem-like plant part that's located between the kernel and the base of the plant. Next up, uh, looking at the yellow arrow, it's the seminal root system, which is the primary root system of that corn plant, you know, up until V3, V4, that is. It is used to anchor the corn seedling and facilitate um, a little bit of nutrient water uptake at that time. To sum it all up, when that corn plant advances from V3, it begins to shift its nutritional dependence on that nodal root system. Then, as I alluded to before, the photosynthetic capacity or factory of that plant begins to increase. You know, this allows that plant to get ready to take off and move from that uh, yellow, green, ugly corn phase to that dark green a really nice attractive corn plant. Thank you and be safe.